go to Mario Jump and toggle that on. So now whenever I jump, <laughs> this sound. <laughs> let's uh, place it, place some XP, and when I clicked it, there we go. Just collecting coins. <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to be just showing you how I how I did this uh, real quick. So let's uh, join some. There we go. So play sound. So first off, what you want to do is grab your files on the internet. So you can download them anywhere, or you can just record your own with a voice recorder or whatever. Um, and then you need to like drag those over to website and convert them to the .ogg format. The .ogg format is a compressed version uh, format that's um, used by Minecraft. All Minecraft sounds are in that format. And once you have that, you want to drag and drop it quickly into the sounds folder in the common mac uh, light config common macros sounds folder. And there you'll be able to um, go head back in game and be able to use them. Now, to be able to use them, you'll be needing to use the play sound button. So if I was to go over to the on, X, on XP change event, so on that on that event, the play sound uh, command will be triggered here, and I put in custom dot, and then the name of the sound file that I put in in the OGG format in the sounds folder. So in this case, it is called Mario Coin because I have a Mario Coin OGG file inside of my folder. <laughs> so once that's done, let me just save that. There we go. And head over to my XP. So uh, I can now hear the coin effect with the XP sound. And now one last, one last thing to, for the jumping. I made a very quick script for the jumping so I can toggle uh, a jumping viable on or off. So either it's toggled on and it will do this loop while the condition is uh, true. So while Mario jump is true, the thing that I'm toggling up here, that I'm logging, whether it's on or off over here, um, what it does is simply get your old position. It waits four ticks. Four ticks is about 200 milliseconds because one millisecond is 50 milliseconds or 20 ticks is one second. Anyways, um, so every four ticks, it checks if your old position is less than your new position. So uh, in this case, if I go up, it goes up, but if I go up slab as well, it'll go up, and if I fly up, it'll go up a lot as well. Um, I Yeah, this is a very quick script, so uh, I haven't really gone into detail about it, I've just, this is to showcase the play sound command, and here you have the custom dot Mario jump. Now, you can also use the uh, default um, sounds that are inside the Minecraft uh, folders, so this is for example the UI toast in. Oops, uh, might want to refresh. There you go. So the Mario toast in. Uh, let's jump. Uh, but there can be others. For example, you can do, um, if, I, if I remove that, entity.wolf.owl, for example. And I want it to have a sound of about 50% so it goes from 0 to 100 and let's save that um, Let's restart the toggle off and on And there we go. There's there's your wolf howl um, every time you jump <laughs> So yeah, I hope if you all enjoyed that um, you can come up with all your sounds you can customize your game with all the sounds that you want um, there's so many things that you can do with this and that's why I'm showing it all off I hope you'll enjoy it and see you in the next one